What's up, YouTube? <laughs> this is going to be a little bit different than what I usually do, and I hope this doesn't turn people off that usually watch my channel. But if you usually watch my channel, this is always part of it anyway. So, if you're here, thank you. So, uh, I, I made a video of the other night, and it was with my Migos and my comics together, and that video was an hour long. And thank God you people sit through that shit. <laughs> Why sit there and think, oh, people are going to sit through an hour video and shit, 45 minute video. I don't think about it. I fucking get drunk and ramble, and then I end it, and it's 45 minutes, an hour, and I'm fucked. So I'm happy when, when, you know, there's some views, but... So I figured I got so many Migos right now that I better just pull them out and do a separate video for Migos, and then the video coming after this... My God, I have a key book that is the key book of key books to me. It's one of those books that you'd fuck. You know, y'all got that book you'd fuck. Come on, be honest. Which key book would you fuck? I'm waiting. Put it in the put it in the box down below. <laughs> Eyes or whatever. So. <laughs> oh, so I actually filmed a video, like I said, that's an hour long. So if people actually enough people told me to post that one, I would. The thing is, I go on a rant, and it's not an a, an evil rant or angry rant. It was a rant about telling people because I bought my first CGC, first one I've ever owned, and I just I don't want to discourage people from buying people that are new in the community to come in and watch these videos. They just popped on YouTube and they want to learn about comics. And they see people show 9.8 CGC, blah, 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 blah. And then they're fucking discouraged. They don't want to fucking... This hobby's too expensive. That's going to kill the hobby, man. Of course, you know, also maybe we can keep some people out and that will help with... I don't know. But, you know, I can get into that too, but... But I just... I don't want people to come to the community thinking it's all about... How much bigger your dick is in, in the next guy. you got to make your dick bigger, you know? So... So I'll post that video. No people ask. It's an hour-long video. Even though I get two views, I'll fucking do it. But but it's got the same Migos. Well, actually, there's one included that wasn't in that one. No, there's two. So I'll do it. Maybe if four of you watch it, whatever. Then uh, but there's some ranting. But I like I said, I don't. I'm not angry. I'm just trying to prove a point that we got to protect these new people coming in. Because that's the people they're going to. Uh, the young ones. They're going to come in. They're going to keep this community. The comic thing alive, so I don't have that much vodka. I literally started this tonight with like this much, and I mean that's like fucking ten minutes for me. So I've been taking it slow. I got a slight little buzz. I never sip it, so we're gonna try something new. Okay, so this is about Migos, man. So any of you people who don't give a shit about Migos, then, uh, I don't know, go fuck a key book, key, uh, issue or something. You know you do it. <laughs> okay, first, speaking of that, you want to see my Peter? I, I know that's why you're here, to see my Peter. Woo, there it is, look at that. Got makeup on my Peter, too. This is the, uh, I wasn't going to buy these. I have all these series of the Kiss Dolls, and uh, I wasn't going to buy the the Love Gun editions because I actually have two of the original Migos, Paul and Gene, in the 12-inch the version from the original original 77 run or whatever, 78, 77, so I didn't care to buy these, but they marked these down so fucking cheap because apparently everybody else thought the same thing. I've already got them in 12-inch. So they marked them down, and I fucking bought them. So at this point, now all I need is a Sonic Boom set. And actually, I'll go ahead and get into this. Any of you guys who are into Migos or thinking about Migos, there's also, they're coming out with two more series of Kiss. They're doing a Dynasty, which if you're fucking just thinking about maybe getting Kiss dolls, that's the fucking set to get. Dynasty. So there's going to be a, a series of 8 and 12 inch Dynasty dolls, and they're doing fucking Destroyer. So, I mean, how can you say fucking no? No, you can't. So, get off your ass, beg your wife for a fucking credit card, do dishes, whatever you gotta do. 
I mean, that's fucking some good shit. And so there's six six series, so the only one I need is Sonic Boom. So I have five series of the Kiss Dolls. There's the Paul Stanley. These are pretty much exact replicas of the 12-inch from 1977, 78. That's pretty sad that I'm a Kiss fan and Amigo, and I can't tell you the exact date, because they don't have tits on it, so... It's got to have tits on it if I'm going to remember anything. Ace Frehley! Ace Frehley! Lead ukulele! There's, a uh, Gene Simmons. Look, 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 we're twins. Okay. Oh, here, here's an exclusive of, well, it's not, I guess you can call it an exclusive. Maybe, maybe not. Exclusive. This is, there's only going to be a thousand of these made. So if you're going to get Migos, or the Remigos, and you want this character, you better fucking do it now because supposedly there's only a thousand. The one I bought is number 12. I probably should have kept it in the package, but I don't give a fuck because I'm not buying them to sell them. He's there to display next to my Shazam. So, motherfucker, look at that. Damn! Dr. Savannah. Fucking love that. But, dude, he's, he's so tiny. He's so short. I mean, that face, my wife says that face creeps her out. She's like, turn him around. I don't want to look at him. And he just looks like he'd be like, nyeh, 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 <laughs> nyeh, nyeh. So, um, oh yeah, I just got this too. There's a series of, uh, Conan dolls. I don't remember who, Howard. Howard's the only number, uh, name coming to my mind. Uh, the guy who created Conan and... And, uh, I don't know, anyways. Fuck. See? I'd remember better if I had a lot of vodka in me than just a little bit of vodka. So anyways, this was another one of the characters in the... In the there's three dolls. King Cole, Conan, and there's motherfucking... This is, uh... Solomon. No. Solomon Kane, yeah. Solomon Kane. And this guy has so much shit on him. Look at that. That is so awesome. And you know what? Now that I look at him. Wow. Now that I look at him. Huh. Any KISS fans? Remember the movie? KISS Meets a Phantom of the Park? Does that not look like the Phantom of the Park? <laughs> the mad scientist? That does. So maybe I'll buy one of these, chop off all his hair, and make a fucking custom uh, phantom of the park. So, there we go. Oh, just bought this. Look at this. Look at this. These Migos get better. There's something here for everybody. So don't go nowhere. Unless you can go fuck a key book. That, that I understand. So here's uh, Kevin Smith's uh, Blunt Man. See, he's got a big old pot leaf. Let's legalize that shit, okay? Go ahead. Let's legalize it. Because, legalize it because I got two hands. I can have Doritos in this hand, and I can have this in the other hand. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's fucking amazing. <laughs> oh, my God. Look at the fucking facial experience. That looks just like Kevin Smith. So, legalize that shit. What does that mean? So, anyways, okay, here we go. Here's a... <laughs> Chronic, so Blunt Man and Chronic, so Batman and Robin, so to speak. See, but he's a potly funny. Woohoo! He's got a little rolled smoking joint on there. So, not to get political, but let's fucking legalize that shit. It ain't hurt nobody. Look, this is hurting more people than fucking. Uh, you know. So, so Blunt Man Chronic, I mean, you get. They're making Migos and everything now. So, if, if you want to get into Migos, but I don't see the kind of stuff that I'm into. <laughs> Trust me, they make it. They've got a Rocky doll. They've got Ash from fucking... Uh, what's the fucking Living Dead series, whatever. Um, They've got fucking shit. I mean, tr trust me. If you're into something, look them up. Oh, Doctor Who. they got Doctor Who Migos, so I'm, just, I'm not into that. But actually... If you mark it down cheap enough and it's Mego, I'm a Mego whore, so I'll buy it. Which uh, is what happened, actually. I never thought I'd buy these. 
And now that I bought them, I fucking love them. And it's re-sparked my fucking love for the old Universal stuff. So these are the Universal Monsters. That is the Metaluna. And I actually have two of these because I bought a lot. And I put the other one we have in a flea market in my town for 15 bucks. Can you imagine? So I'm selling one of these for 15 bucks. That's pretty sad. I think I paid fucking 30 for the one I got. But oh, the Metal Luna. Look at that. I know Hippie. Hippie will love these. And Captain, of course, loves these. I know he does. So Look at his back. Oh. The little... And I actually went to uh, watch This Island Earth that these guys are from. And, man, they're barely in the movie. So I was really disappointed. So Okay, and there's also... Uh, is that Bella Lugosi? Is that who that is? I don't know. I don't know my... But this is Phantom of the Opera. Look how fucking great that is. I mean, hippie. Captain, how can you not get behind these? I mean, 8-inch goodness. Posable. I mean, are you guys a little older than me? But if you were a kid and you had these fucking dolls, it was the most amazing thing in the world. It was. So, ask a, ask a 45-year-old. <laughs> Tap a 45-year-old on the shoulder and go, you have fucking Migos? How was it? They go fucking orgasmic, brother. So, here's the mummy. Actually, I'm, I'm saying this like there's another fucking, another universal monster, which there is actually a bunch more. And the next one I'm buying is a... Uh, Creature from Black Lagoon. But look at these. I mean, that's look at his fucking tatters hanging off of him. That is not his taters, his tatters. I'd imagine there's taters in his ears after that long. I remember my mom would say, "You got taters in your ears. Let's clean them taters out." I'm like, "Taters? I'm scared. I got potatoes? What the fuck's up with that shit?" So, okay, uh, uh, speaking, let's go on the mods. But fuck, let's drink. Let's legalize marijuana because I need an alternative. Can you can you see that? After every comic. <laughs> Here's a comic I bought for uh What was I saying? <laughs> That's what it'd be here. So fucking hot. <laughs> Cause that's the way you smoke it. I don't fucking know, man. Look, this one's gonna be an hour long too. Why did I cut the video in half? So, anyways, okay, here we go. Another one of my favorite fucking properties is fucking Star Trek. Who doesn't love them some motherfucking Star Trek? So, this is a replica of the original Star Trek. There's a line called, you know, uh, Star Trek Aliens or whatever. Most of those are fucking highly sought after and motherfucking expensive. So, I, you know, Migos are my first love. I gotta say, because when I was a kid, I mean, I, I loved my comics. Loved my comics. But I would have fought you over Amigo. So, I wouldn't necessarily fought over a comic unless it's maybe, I don't know, something special. I would have fought you over a Captain America comic when I was a kid. But uh, these are reissues, so I'm not going to spend a million dollars on these because the money I could spend on a, a, an original of this, I could buy, I don't know, maybe that key that I said I'd fuck, and I did. I didn't fuck it, not yet. <laughs> oh, I can hear the deletes. Delete, 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 delete. So, that was Mugato. Wait, 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 wait. Mugato? Metaluna. So here's a, uh, 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 fuck. It's pretty bad. I can't remember his name. But he's fucking ugly. I don't know. The keeper, the keeper. We ain't a keeper of teeth. That's for sure. He's got two, two teeth. So, and here's one that's not an exclusive, but it, I think later on it's gonna be one that's gonna be a little harder to find. 
and I bought it as soon as it came out, as soon as I seen it. I paid a little bit, and I actually see it coming down now, but I think this is going to be one later on, but if you like it, you better get it now. So, full motherfucking salt vampire. Remember that episode? Dr. McCoy made out with this fucking thing. And see? Apparently, it took the keeper's teeth, because it's got extra. So, not gonna make any comments about that, but oh, we still got so many Migos to go. That's why I had to make a video of just Migos because oh my god, I've been working so hard at my job, get so much overtime, so that's where all this money came from. My wife don't know, but so here we go. Let's get into this. This is something that Howler Mouse, you love, man. Uh, I know. Well, fuck, uh, Shannon, uh, Solid ST Bin, you fucking love this. Um, there's so many people who love this. I mean, I can't just say, I, I'd imagine Hippie loves it just as much. I'd imagine, but I mean, oh my god. If you're going to get into Migos, the old ones are really hard to get. Well, no, not, not really. I mean, it's not impossible. I mean, if you can afford a comic, you can lay down some money for some of these originals. And uh, this is a new from NECA. And actually, I put the bandolier on him because it didn't come with one, which looked really stupid. So, but it's a gorilla soldier. I fucking love it. Love this fucking. Yeah, so. <laughs> I love the 8 inch scale. <laughs> I'd imagine if I was gay, I'd want it 8 inches. I don't know. No, the 8 inch scale is great, so. And I'm not gay, so. <laughs> 8 inch nipples on a tit? I don't know. Delete, 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 delete. So, <laughs> here, here's another Rod Serling. That was actually Rod Serling had something to do with Planet Apes, in case people didn't know that. Rod Serling actually had a hand in the Planet Apes movie, which you can tell because the ending is pretty much a Twilight Zone episode. So, here's a Twilight Zone doll from, uh. Is it called the eye and actually as I was buying these a lot of these I didn't know what the fuck they were so as I buy them I go on YouTube and watch these episodes so so but I was this one's great if you haven't seen it yeah so um some more Twilight Zone dolls so um these are the the aliens. That's what they're dubbed. And this is the episode where is it the the guys in the fucking the bar or the cafeteria, whatever the fuck is going on in that fucking Pizza episode. But anyways, he's a, he's a fucking tall teller. Always telling tall tales. Well, he leaves. People make fun of him because he tells tall tales, and I think that's the way it went. I, I might have been drunk when I watched those too. Bear with me. I might have been. So. uh... This was, uh, they abduct him, and I think they're going to kill him or something at the end. And I remember he, he wants, oh, he's a harmonica player, so yeah, he, he wants to play a song before he goes. He's going to play that song. He's going to play that song. So he, and that's the thing that kills these guys. So, and if you remember, that's the same thing that happened in, uh, not Independence Day, but, uh, Uh, Martians, uh, old son of a fucking donkey fucker. Um, Martians. Anyways, remember, their fucking heads explode in their helmet. Uh, it's gonna bug me. Mars attacks. There we go. So here's from the Alicia episode of, and I actually have not. This is of all the dolls I bought. This is not. This is one episode I haven't went and watched. And I thought I'd watched all fucking Twilight Zone episodes. So I fucking love Twilight Zone. My two favorite TV shows of all time are Twilight Zone, the original, and fucking Family Guy. And I don't know if I show it on here, but. I am Quagmire, kind of. 
I may not be as handsome as Quagmire. I don't fly planes, but but uh, there's Alicia. Look, I love that her sandals are. Yeah, that's awesome. So got a little robot face. Mm -hmm. Um. Oh yeah. Here is uh. Oh shit! I'm missing a part of the. Uh, I'm missing a part of something. Here's the episode called Masks, I think. So there's Jason Foster. I think there's like the, he's dying and he's put all these people in his will. And he brings them all together, he makes them put on these masks before uh, he dies and reads a will and whatever. And when they pull off their fucking masks, their face actually looks like the mask to show that that's who they really are. I think that's how it went. So, gotta love fucking Twilight Zone. But I mean, I love his look. He's got his fucking little. I can make a uh, Hugh Hefner custom doll with his little fucking uh, his little sleeper uh, sleeper coat, whatever you call those. Um, yeah, here we go. Remember this episode of Twilight Zone? This is the. Uh, the nurse from the, uh, ooh, look at that, mm, pig nose, pig nose. So, what's that episode called? Oh, uh, uh, Eye of the Beholder, there we go. So, love, love me, fucking, I just love 8-inch scale dolls, man. Love Migos, I mean, these aren't technically, technically Migos, but anybody who's a Migo lover, as long as you're satisfied with the scale and the shape of the body, they'll call it Amigo. If not, then you get particular and you've got the, the DC Retro Mattel ones. I don't consider those Amigos. When they make copies of those in Amigo scale, Amigo body, Migo, then I'll rebuy those fucking things. But, you know. So, I don't know, I'm not speaking for Amigo community, but would you like me to be your spokesman? Amigo? Okay, well, yeah, and I, I showed this in a video before. This is the William Shatner uh, Terror at 1,000 feet or whatever. Is that what it is? I, I He was on the box when I showed you, but I opened him. The only reason I opened him is what the fuck is going on there? Oh, he's kind of building the cord. Oh, his mommy didn't cut it. Okay, well, so there's William Shatner, which I don't think it looks a damn thing like William Shatner. So, I'm, I opened it because I bought this. That's the uh, the Gremlin. This is he looks out the window. He's like, and this is what you see when he looks out the window. He sees this. That's pretty horrifying for back in the day, man. That's nah, pretty comical, because look, he's in like a fucking... You know what he looks like right here? You know what he looks like right here? If you look at this... <laughs> this looks like um, a Christmas story when they put... <laughs> when they put the kid in the fucking bunny suit. That's about what that looks like. Put some bunny ears on it. Kid cried. No, he didn't cry. Yeah, that's later on when he's in this fucking snow suit. That's Ralph that's in this. But anyways, look at that. I mean, that's fucking... And look, he's got a soft... I mean, this is this is literally not even... There's fat body, Mego bodies. So, but all they did on this one is put padding. So it's just... He's not even fat. you got the fat bodies. Put him on a fat body. So... <laughs> oh, okay. And this, this right here, I gotta go get the thing that came with it, so... Enjoy the music. Is this getting good, folks? Oh, well. Look, I'm almost at 400 subscribers. By tomorrow morning, I should be about 
320. So, anyways, this is uh, well, we won't show the. Does anybody know what this is? Do any of you fellow Twilight Zone fans know what this is? How about this? It's a cookbook! Oh my god, it's a cookbook! So, <clears throat> comes with a lunchbox. I wish I was a fucking kid so I could take this. They're the same on both sides, but man, I want I want to be a kid so I can go to lunch with this. So, oh my god. Okay, and the doll that came with it, right there. Look at that. Oh. It looks like my buddy Matt. My buddy Matt looks just like that. He's even got that shave shave pattern there and dark dark eyes. He wears robes. I don't know. Here. Look at that. He had kiss boots on. I wonder if they used. No, they couldn't have. So I wonder if they used the same. Nope. So I wonder if they used the same boots that are on the kiss dolls. Because Migos really infamous for reusing things. So, and I imagine the new people have learned from Mego to re, and all toy companies do it. But anyways, so I got three more dolls to show, and then we're done. And then, uh, and then I don't know, you guys go back to your life. So, we're at 27 minutes, let's do this. Okay, when I did my contest, I asked people, um, pick a Mego that you'd want. If you won, and I'd buy it for you. And Doc and Hallett, Doc and Chris, and I, he picked Wolverine. I said, there's no way I could buy you Amiga Wolverine because the fucking, the pack was way too expensive. And I said, I'll never own it. So, and I told him I'd buy the, they, they had the Mattel. It's Mattel. Toy Biz, whatever, whatever the fucking nine inch scale Migos were. And actually, those the Wolverine ones are kind of sucking because the rubber on their heads, the masks, is starting to uh, seep. So the, the fucking the mask is real fucking sticky and shit. So if you had one and it's in the package, maybe it's okay. You don't have to touch it. But yeah, those things are fucking biodegrading right now, so don't buy them. So, but I fucking made so much money lately that I did buy the three pack and. Uh, Here's the thing though, it comes with one body. So you have three suits and one body, and you gotta pick which one you're gonna do. Well, I've got all kinds of Mego bodies laying around. So I said, well fuck, I'll have all three of them motherfuckers. I'm like, I'm so fucking sly, motherfuckers don't do that shit, cause they don't know. You don't, you don't know to buy some extra bodies? I have extra bodies on hand. So here's the problem. They don't fit Amigo body. <laughs> so, the head on this is always falling off. It's just slightly smaller. So, I guess I'm not so fucking sly. And, uh, yeah, the people who made these are. But that's the Logan one. So, Doc and Chris, that's for you, man. Um, which one is the one? Okay. So, here's the, the secondary suit. Oh, the, actually, the main suit. And I actually swapped the bodies out because I actually wanted the other body. Because he had the mask to be the, the body that came with it. So this is another Mego body I had. So as long as these aren't moved, a Mego body works. So, But uh, I love that. So there's actually a mask that comes with it, and it's actually buried up. It's it's like a removable mask that fits on top, and it's yeah, it's kind of lame. But they tried to make this one look like what if they had made a Mego in 1978 or beyond a Wolverine. This is what it would look like. So that's supposed to be retro. So here's a Mego in the style of today, where they give Wolverine his uh. And see, actually, see how that's kind of off? It's not quite brown. It's not quite yellow. And that's supposed to be able to be put on both Wolverines. 
And actually, you know what? I may put it on the other one. It's just the fact that it's not quite yellow kind of bugged me. But, you know, looking at that, it's not quite brown either, so. Motherfuckers. And it actually tells you in there, you can paint it. Well, motherfucker, you paint it. I paid for that fucking shit. <laughs> so, but I love his claws. Look at that shit. Actually, these are, these are Dr. Migo. Any of you guys are into the Migos? Dr. Migo had a big hand in this, and, and he knows what he's doing, so I'm not going to complain. So, love you, Dr. Migo. Paul Clark, man. You the man. So, um, I know there was something else I was going to say. Oh, yeah, yeah. If you're into Migos, what the 30 minute mark. See, I can't fucking make a short video. If you guys are into Migos, here's some things that are coming out. Um, like I said, the Kiss Dynasty, I said the Kiss Destroyer Dolls. There's an Apache Chief coming out. There's a fucking, uh, a Samurai. There's a, from DC, there's a fucking Scarecrow. There's a Raza Ghoul coming out. I mean, now's the time to get into them, because these things are fucking hot. And, uh, there, there's the Wonder Twins. There's, uh, I'm trying to think on the website. I mean, I go to this website and it tells you what's coming out, what's coming soon. But there's so many, there's a Hawkman, a Green Lantern, a Flash. There's fucking Jimmy Olsen. There's fucking Perry White. There's fucking uh, Lois Lane. There's so many new Migos coming out. I mean, it's, it's a good time to be an adult where I can buy these motherfuckers, but it sucks because I can't play with them. I mean, I could, but... I mean, I'll play with them. You guys can't... You won't know. My wife, my wife commits me. Half of you will be going, it's because he's a drunk. And the other half will go, no, because she caught him playing with Migos. So, which is it? Maybe I was drunk playing with Migos. So, love you guys. Thank you. I've got this fucking video coming soon. I got so many good books in that one. I'm telling you, it is the key fucker for me, man. I think it's probably the biggest key. The most keys, the biggest keys, and the most happy keys I've had in, in one video. And it's got my major key. So, it's, uh, it's coming. So, Love you guys, and we're actually going to finish, finish this under 35 minutes, so I love you guys, and uh, keep showing up. I know I don't do this often, but I'm glad you guys stay there, and I love you. So, okay. Hey, Captain, I got a vacation coming, so let's plan something. I don't know. Okay, later, guys.